All right. This is the cordal, is what I called it. Uh, first thing you want to do whenever you're making an instrument is make a box. If you don't know how to make a box, you can look up my video on how to make a box. Uh, the resonator in this case is just a cookie tin. And uh, get this off here. You can see inside there, just got screws. Uh, you can see on the sides there, there's actually a pretty decent amount of room. I made the box a little bit big, and uh, they're not really held. <clears throat> the tin isn't held on there that well. I left the lid on just for more structural. So anyway, when you're building an instrument, you need something to hold strings. I got uh, some nails there. Um, you need a bridge and then some sort of nut. Uh, the bridge here just kind of sets directly on the tin. Uh, and then I just have the uh, machine heads there, arbitrarily attached. I also left, obviously, a, a space to allow the sound to come out of this area. Um, you can see in there, originally it was going to have eight strings. Uh, it was just too much for the shape of the box. It wasn't structurally sound enough. And then I put in, you know, I put in, like, trim pieces to make it all look nice. You, you obviously don't have to do something like that. And that's pretty much it. I mean, this is really basic design. I don't know anything about making instruments when I decided to make these. Um, I just kind of winged it. And uh, I think pretty much anyone can do it, so you should, uh, you should give it a shot.